Am I out of your league? Because all the things I did for you right there was to be in your league. Because you're dumb. You understand? You're dumb. See, right now you're like, he's up. He's out of my league. So that's why I do stupid things for you so I can be in your league. I go, you know, something stupid like that. Am I breathing correctly? Huh? Am I talking correctly? Do you want a lower voice? Do you want a lower like this? Do you want to talk like this? Am I in your league now? Do you want me to show you my wallet? You want to see how much money I have in it? When am I going to be in your league? Because everything is stupid. Anyways, this video is about being in someone's league and saying people that say I'm out of your league or you're out of their league. That is the that is the most annoying thing I've ever heard in my life. Every time I hear that, it just sounds like some hating ass loser. It's just, it has to be a hater. Because there's nothing worse. And I, this happened many times. Let me give you a few examples. Let's say I'm walking with my friend. Well, let me do the quotes because who knows who's your friend nowadays. But I was walking with my friend. This is a real story, by the way. I was walking with my friend. And then he sees a ah, girl. He's like, wow, she's hot. She's hot. Oh, my God. I'm too scared of her because I'm insecure. Anyways, uh, the point is you shouldn't be insecure, by the way. You're beautiful. But anyways, and then he sees her boyfriend come. All of a sudden, he goes, why the fuck is she with that nerd? Why is it? Hey, she's, she's, he's definitely out of her league. No. Seems like you're out of her fucking league because you're not with her, you piece of shit. Stop hating so hard. Stop being jealous. She's with him. Get over it. Stop telling. First of all, who cares about your fucking opinion about who's out of whose league? There's no such thing as that. They just want to make it seem that way to make themselves seem better. You know, I like it when the comedians do it. It's fucking funny. Like when they have a girlfriend that's hot or whatever. And they're like, she's way better than, she's ba she's way better than I am. Or she's, she's too good for me. It's a funny joke. But if you actually believe that someone's too good for you, God damn it. God damn it. That makes me very sad. It makes me so sad that I just slapped the desk twice. Did you hear that? Hold on. Can you hear that? Or are you ins too insecure? To is this out of your league or what? Is that out of your league too? Or what, me doing that? Anyways, um, the point is it pisses me off for people to be that insecure to actually believe that there's people that are out of their league. Like there's some special thing in the world where there's some special human being and you can't be with that human being. But you know what's funny? You can literally have your head completely chopped off, right? As long as you're famous or you have money, you're not out of anyone's league. That's the, that's the funniest part of it. The number one thing to be in anyone's league is to be rich. <laughs> I guess so. doesn't matter how you look. And that, and that they're like, why is she with that ugly motherfucker? He's like, he, she, he's, he's rich. And then you're like, oh. Then she's out of his league then. Or whatever the case. It's just so corny. Mind your own business. Stop being jealous of who somebody is with. There's no such thing as out of anyone's league. Everyone is amazing. Get over it. In reality, all this stuff is man-made anyways. Whatever we think is beauty, all this stuff is fake. Do you understand? The cavemen didn't know what the fuck was models and shit. Like, they just went ooga booga. That's them fucking, obviously. Ooga, ooga, booga, 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 ooga, and booga. And the girl's like, ooga, booga. You know, that's them coming or whatever. That I don't even think the, to be honest with you, I don't think the, the caveman even cared about making the, the female come, to be honest with you. Unless she didn't come fast or something. But, you know, that's a, that's a whole other story. She didn't even care. But uh, anyways, um, yeah, being out of people league, all that stuff, it just makes me laugh so goddamn much. It's just hilarious to me. And if you ever think you're out of someone's league, well, that's a lot. That is a big, gigantic lie. The only time someone is out of your league is let's say you're a really good person. You're great to be around and you have a nice heart. And that person is a piece of shit. Now they're out of your league. That's how I see it. Um, that's all I got to say about that one. Uh, yeah, that's good enough. All right, bye. Oh, yeah, and I'm not out of any of your... Uh, I'm not out of your league at all. You want to know who's out of my league? That dog that keeps barking outside of my house. 
over there. I wish I was a sniper and I could just snipe him. Uh, sorry, PETA, I'll snipe you guys in the head too for saying that. Obviously, it's called a joke, but that dog's annoying. And I'm never going to go out with that dog. It's out of my league. You want to know why? Because I don't do bestiality, baby. Anyways, all right. Uh, see you guys later. Um, thank you for watching this video. Subscribe. Uh, subscribe. I don't think uh, subscribing is out of your league. Uh, thank you for watching the video, though. But can you subscribe or what? Thank you for subscribing. Oh, yeah, and I'm not out of your league. That's what I was going to say. I'll fuck anyone. I'll literally put a hole in the goddamn wall. I'll throw some milk in it. Only oat milk in there or, or coconut milk, those kind of milks. Put that in there and then fuck it. Because not even the wall is out of my league. Appreciate it. Thanks, man.